to today's vlog I'm sorry that this is kind of like a late vlog I usually upload every week but I think I'm gonna upload this eight days after my last video but since I feel like I always give you guys like the same not the same content but I always vlog on Wednesdays I wanted to switch it up and I wanted to vlog on Thursday and I want to show you guys my Thursday instead and kind of just do something different you know um, today, surprisingly, I was able to get up. Praise the Lord. That was all God because I fell asleep so late last night. Um, but I was able to get up and do my quiet time. And I kind of just wanted to share what I've been doing. Something that's been helping me. I'm basically just meditating on... Because I was doing this... I, I've been reading the Bible, right? But I've been like so focused on just reading, 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 reading that I don't stop to meditate on the Word and we're supposed to meditate on it. So what I did is I stopped trying to just read, 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 read. I stopped and I started going through Psalms. I started writing down all the verses I highlighted and I started meditating on them in this way, just by writing them down. And I actually really love this. Um, it's helped me even memorize scripture too, writing them down. And then I just go through it. You know, I don't even need to grab my Bible. I could just grab this when I want to meditate on scriptures and just meditate on these scriptures in here. So that's what I've been doing. It's been helping me a lot. Also, if you guys follow me on Instagram, I kind of shared some scriptures on laziness because I've been battling laziness and it's like a real thing it, it'll happen it could be a spirit it could be your flesh it could be a little bit of both who knows but most likely your flesh because the flesh is like you know but every time I listen to proverbs every day I try to listen to proverbs every day I do miss some days but whenever I listen to proverbs this scripture always stands out go to the ant oh sluggard Consider her ways and be wise. Without having any chief, officer, or ruler, she prepares her bread in the summer and gathers her food in harvest. How long will you lie there, O sluggard? When will you arise from your sleep? A little sleep, a little slumber, a little folding of the hands to rest, and poverty will come upon you like a robber and want like an armed man. Every time I will listen to Proverbs, this would stick out so much. And if you guys don't know what sluggard means, it basically means a lazy, sluggish person. And I feel like I've been kind of stuck in this place for a while already. Um, I even had goals to start working out, and I don't because I'm just being lazy, like just being flat out honest. So, um, I've been just trying to make some changes in that area and just be more, you know, not even... Not even be more physically fit just for myself and for my own desires and for my own gain or for me to boast in my body like none of that like this is all coming out of like I don't want to be lazy anymore I think I finally hit the point where I'm like I can't do this anymore like I can't be like this anymore like so I've made some new workout goals and I am doing all home workouts. I wanted to go back to the gym, but I just decided that I don't want to go back to weightlifting just yet at the gym because it's very easy, especially if you're coming out of that, very easy to get into your ego, to get into your pride and start lifting out of ego, start lifting out of pride. It's very easy to fall into that if that used to be your personality. Um, this is not the case for everyone, but I just feel like I need a little bit longer break from it for now. So what I am doing is Chloe Ting's workouts and her workouts are freaking hard. 
it's all body weight stuff but they're really challenging i did my first day on tuesday i rested on wednesday and today will be my third day i'm doing her two-week challenge i'll probably do it for four weeks though so that is like my fitness goal right now and it's not to look a certain way or lose a certain amount of pounds i mean that's gonna come with it but it's mainly because i just want to be able to run faster for the kingdom of god and just be able to you know take on more and not be so overwhelmed because i'm being lazy i just don't want to be lazy anymore thanks for coming to my ted talk i just wanted to update you guys on what's going on with me that's what's happening i feel like this intro is already three hours long but let's get this day started um amelia sleeping because want to see her Yeah, so I'm me sleeping. I'm already in my workout clothes, so I'm probably gonna start getting ready to do all that. I'm not gonna eat breakfast because I ate literally so many croissants. You know, when it comes to eating healthy, I'm not gonna be crazy because I've been crazy before and I don't like that. I'm gonna be, and by crazy I mean like counting every single calorie, like I can't eat a bread, I can't eat, no, I'm not gonna be doing that. Balance, baby. Basically, if I wanna eat a cookie, I'm gonna eat a cookie. Okay, I'm not gonna eat, you know, a whole pack of cookies. I'll eat one cookie Balance, it's all about balance, but I ate like I think how many croissants did I eat yesterday? These little tiny croissants. I think I ate four of them That's a lot So I might work out fasted. I'm not sure. I'm gonna wait for Amelia to wake up So I can feed her because if she wakes up in the middle of my workout, she's gonna be like, where's my food at mom? What happened? I jumped a post. <laughs> you what? Oh, baby. I think she said I dropped the clothes. I wonder what she was dreaming about. Hi. Good morning. You want to play? Or are you gonna build a house? Okay. So I was just cleaning up a little bit. I cleaned my floors yesterday. And get a candle burning here. And yeah, it's clean. I cleaned my floors yesterday. And I have this mop. I have the mop that uses this head. This head. And you know what I figured out? It's easy. Easier than to just use. I use. Two mop heads. I use two mop heads and basically what I do is I use the first one, I clean the floor, I take it off, I put on the other one, and then I do the second passing and then I stick those in the washer because I hate washing mops. It's so annoying. And the washer cleans them way better than I do. So that's what I do. I put those I put them to wash after I use them and then for the next time I use one mop head and then I use a second mop head and that's it. My floor is clean. So Amelia's awake. I'm probably gonna cut. I'm probably gonna make her like a little fruit bowl with some strawberries and blackberries. I think. Do you want strawberries and blackberries and blueberries? Yeah. Yeah. So that's what I'm gonna do for her right now. You're playing. Sorry, I'm dropping stuff. Yeah, I did. <laughs> Did you guys see that? dropping <laughs> stuff. Make it a bowl. Here's the bowl. Did anyone did anyone else parents show their love like this? I did this my Yes, baby, this is yours. Like my dad wouldn't do this, but he would always just bring me fruit to my to my room. Like while I was watching TV or studying. Here you go, baby. Thank you. You like it? It's so pretty. Can you take a picture of it? Take a picture of it with you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> you like it? You can put it right here, baby. You know, I usually don't let her eat on the bed, but... She's too cute right now. She's playing. So... And our bed, and our bed is our couch too, so 
There's a little bit of, you know, room no. to be lenient. Yeah. I'm there. <laughs> our bed is our couch, so I do let her eat on there sometimes. Here's our breakfast. <laughs> so, I was going to eat. I was going to work out fasted, but I was just way too hungry. And I don't want to get into bad eating habits, like starving myself if I no. ate too much the day before. Um, I don't think that's a good idea. So I'm going to eat, and me and Amelia are eating together. It's been a while. i honestly been lacking in this area, but we're getting it together. So we're going to eat, and I think I'll work out when she goes to that's sleep. That's water! Oh, we have to pray. Bless this food that is before us, this home around us, and the family beside us, and the love between us. In Jesus' name we pray. Say amen. amen. Thank you. Time to eat. Try to do it in a full range of motion as this will really help. And I'll see you in the next workout. Bye! Amelia's me watching me work out with the cookie. <laughs> I'm not even halfway yet. Doing abs and then core and arms and then cool down and then we're done. I have this unforgettable thing. What the? Sorry, I would let the, the ads play, girl, but I gotta get this workout. This ever loads. But this is what's going on. Melia, eating a cookie? Come on. Me. Freaking out. The TV. I'll link the workout down below. Just tell them. So. Let me give you guys the breakdown of what just happened. Um, so let's go to activity. It's been a minute since I've seen this. I wore my watch. Here it is. 351 calories in total for like an hour. Can you guys see that? Yeah, that was intense. That was fun though. And... Yeah, um, I'm going to start using this again. Um, I'm not like counting how many calories I eat, but I'm going to put my watch to work. And yeah, that was a great workout. I'm going to take a shower now and get ready. And Amelia's going to take a shower too. Sorry this angle, but I'm not wearing a shirt, so. So, that's that. That was cool. That was awesome. Now I'm gonna get ready and so is Amelia. And then we're gonna go to my friend's boutique and hang out. She might fall asleep though, so baby, can you Okay, I'll see you guys when I'm ready. I 10 out of 10 <laughs> I 10 out of 10 recommend trying out that workout. It's really challenging, honestly. It's challenging. But it's all home stuff. You don't need it. You don't need any equipment. So if you guys wanna try it. I will I link it house. down here. Males, if you struggle with lust, I suggest you don't watch the videos because don't go somewhere where you're not supposed to be at. You know, so that's mainly for my girls. I'll link it down below. Guys, I would not go to the video if you struggle with lust. Well, I wanted to add, if you have kids at home, it's definitely doable. <laughs> Amelia was literally trying to do the workouts with me. She got in my way a couple times, but I just rewinded it and redid it. But it was totally doable. It took about an hour. So 10 out of 10 recommend. Check it out, ladies. I'll be linked down below. All right, y'all. So I'm put together. This is part of my not be lazy is actually get ready. And 
Yeah. I'm gonna eat right now stuff I had meal prep. Um, this is from Elia. It's just chicken and rice. I don't want it, mommy. And Amelia doesn't want to eat it, but look at this super cute pin I got from Target. I'm wearing the blue shirt because it's finally hot with white pants because it looks cute. Okay, then you're gonna eat this, okay? It's her. Okay, well wait. Sit down, Mama. Yay! Kids are so much fun. Hi guys. So we just came out of my friend's boutique. It's Ata Boutique, the vintage boutique where I got that 50s dress. I'll link it down below. I was just hanging out with her, having a chat with her. And now we're at Ralph's. What is this car doing? Um, tonight's family group, so I'm gonna bring you guys to family group, so that's gonna be fun. But I'm just picking up the iced coffee that um, we're gonna use because we're having an iced coffee night. Okay, this is LA. Don't act like you've never seen somebody vlogging. Someone just looked at me crazy right now. <laughs> I feel like you see some very distinct characters at Ralph's. Like, like characters, what I mean by characters is just like, they just seem like a movie character. Like they're the main character. I don't know if that makes any sense, but <laughs> that's how I feel like when I come to Ralph's. I don't come to Ralph's at all, but this is just near Alicia's house. So, you ready, baby? Yeah? Okay, let's go get, we're gonna buy you apple juice, right? You're buying an apple juice? And I'm buying coffee for the girls. I'm not sure how much I'm supposed to buy, but let's go. Say hi. You want apple juice? Yeah? Where? Can we find this? You're beautiful. Did you know that? There's apple juice. <laughs> I said you're beautiful. What did you say? My apple juice. Okay, let's go find your apple juice. I love your dress. It's from Target. It was $10. It's literally so cute. Show them what you got. What's that? It's an apple juice. Are you so excited? Yeah. You so excited? Yeah. Okay, I'll open it for you right now, okay? Here we got the coffees. One, two, three, four, five coffees. I'm sweaty. That's all it takes to make a baby happy. One dollar. And I didn't even put that much water in it. She's living her best life right now. Just a little bit. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. No water, just like that. I gave it to her, like just a bottle, but she spilled it, so that's better. Better? Why are you off to the side like that? If you guys are in the Whittier location, any girls, it's a women's group. If you're, if you're a guy, her husband also has a men's group in Whittier. If you guys are in the area and you want to go to group, it's not Zoom, it has to be live. If you guys want to come, um, if you guys want to go to group men's, you can DM her husband. I'll put their Instagrams in the description. If you want to go to group for women's in Whittier, I'll put her Instagram in the description. Okay, I will see you guys at group. Hopefully I get to vlog. Obviously I'll make sure the girls are okay with it um, before I put them on camera, but I'll see you guys at group. You're drinking apple juice? Is it good? Let me see your teeth. Say cheese, I love my apple juice.
Ice coffee night. Um, this is Giselle with the G or G? With the G. Okay, yeah. Because we have a Giselle with the J and a Giselle with the G. Yeah. Here she is. <laughs> she brought tea. Because the tea is hot. Actually, no, it's cold. It's cold. <laughs> you can heat it up. Everybody say hi. 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 Say hi. 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 Say hi. Everyone say hi. Say hi, say hi. Hi, 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 hi. Hi. This is Mia. This is Julie. This is Sandy. Hi. <laughs> this is Alicia. Hi. I'm just like recording everything. Where's the baby at? Look at the baby. <laughs> hi, Nathan. Can't give your life to Jesus. When you left the altar, something happened inside you. But, you're still 20 pounds. <laughs> okay, so maybe you had a mole you didn't like. A mole right here, had a hair flower now. <laughs> he just gave up plucking it because it just grows back. <laughs> how, was your, how was your first family group? Yeah, that's what I'm Yay, she came from YouTube, so everybody's welcome. Tell them you felt welcome, right? Yes. <laughs> Come join us. Yeah. That's what she's known for now. Okay. Hey guys, so I'm home. I really didn't get to get that many clips. But tonight was powerful. God really just moved tonight and you know. Oh, oh. let me help you. The Holy Spirit just did its thing. But yeah, I am gonna go to sleep right now. Let me just say goodbye right here, okay? Give me one second, okay? But tonight was really good. Um, two girls came in. Well, there's actually three girls in the group that came from um, through this YouTube channel and it's just awesome to see the way God can you know bring us all together from like the most random places like YouTube and if you guys are near Whittier I definitely recommend girls you can come to um, the group that I go to Alicia's husband also hosts a group in Whittier for men so it's all men with men and women with women but women girls if you guys want to come, you're near Whittier, let me know and just let me know because, you know, it's a great place to just, I mean, it's a great place to fellowship, get to know people on the same path as you, but most importantly, it's just, you know, a place to encounter God and that's what it's all about. It's all about just encountering God and yeah, it's it's the best, you know, we all just get together to just encounter Jesus and just get a word. And it was awesome. Tonight was awesome. I love family group. If you guys are interested in coming live only, we're not doing Zoom anymore, unfortunately, but we're just doing live. So if you guys are interested, you're near Whittier, let me know. Ladies, I would love to have you guys. Me and Alicia would love to have you guys. But anyways, that's going to be all for today's vlog. It was a long day, but it was awesome. I got a lot done and I'm thankful. I'm very thankful for today. I'm thankful for you all. Thank you for your patience. Sorry I took forever to upload another video, but I am getting on a stricter schedule. I'm going to start giving myself a deadline so I will be more consistent on the days that I post. But I really hope you guys... Shh. just told me to shoe. I really hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. And if you guys want to see any other videos, let me know down below. I love you guys so much, and I will see you in the next video. Say bye. Okay. Say love you guys. Okay.